the Queen joined eager punters at the second day of the Epson Derby ready to cheer on her horse Sexton, who will be racing at 5.15 p.m., in a bright cerulean blue coat with a matching hat. A keen horse lover, the Queen never misses either Royal Lascot or the Epsom Derby, and will be watching her race horse Sexton take part in the Investic out of the ordinary handicap states, the sixth race of the day. Her Majesty began her day at the races by unveiling a statue of the legendary former jockey Lester Piggott. She arrived at today's event wearing a blue coat over a yellow dress with blue flowers. Despite the fact temperatures are expected to reach up to 84 F. Sexton made his debut appearance with the wine at Ascot in May and the Queen will be hoping for another today. The Queen's horses have never previously won at the Epsom Derby. Mr. Newman told the Daily Mail, this year she has a real chance. Sexton was an impressive winner on his debut at Ascot in May and with only four career starts. He should do better still at Epsom. The Queen has Sir Michael Stout as trainer, he has had five Epsom wins to his name, so she a good chance. It will be a pretty warm order given his progressive profile and I expect it to go off as a 2-1 favourite. Her Majesty has won 534 races from 3,205 runs over time as racehorse owner and it is thought she has made pounds 7.7 million from her hobby over the last 31 years. Mr. Newman added, she does it for fun, 100%. There has long been a royal connection with racing that I suspect the Queen enjoys continuing. Her genuine love of the horses is not in question, one look at her face when her horse begins a run or gets to challenge will tell you all you need to know. She turns up come rain or shine at both the Epsom Derby meeting and Royal Lascot and was said to be riding at the age of six before inheriting horses when her father. King George VI, passed away in 1952. A keen horse lover, the Queen never misses either Royal Lascot or the Epsom Derby, eh?